What's up, y'all? Welcome to another review by Ryan. Uh, in today's reaction, in this video, we're going to be reacting to the third episode of The Rising of the Shield Hero Season 2 uh, with the episode titled Shaking Land. So obviously we had some really funny dialogue going on, including about um, <laughs> certain emotions and feelings and education and Right before we got to all the nitty gritty of that, the spirit tourist decided to strike. So that's what we're going to pick up on. And let's go ahead. And get this party started. All right, we're going to go ahead and kick this episode off in three, two, one. Oh, <laughs> I don't lie, Anderson definitely messed me up there. <laughs> Good melting being helpful. Everything's going pretty textbook for a start so far. only relevant one out of your heroes. The only one that matters. <laughs> Look at my Mio. Definitely a change from how things were with him in the first season.
It's the way she's in the outfit, though. <laughs> All right, seems like a pretty textbook start to this fight. You know, nothing too extravagant or extreme. Also, at the end of this reaction, I do plan to talk a little bit about some more commentary regarding how the second season is going and the most recent ratings that came out. So we'll definitely touch base a little bit into that once we get to the end. I really don't like these headphones. Ugh. You know, I think it's always weird when I watch these shows and we have these, like, super large enemies because whether it's CGI, completely drawn, it's always really weird and unique how different animation studios choose to animate these type of creatures, so... It's definitely interesting how it's being animated right now, for sure. If anything, this reminds me a little bit of how I felt about uh, Taimut with um, Fate ba uh, Babylonia arc and how she looked a lot better from a distance than she did up close. Yes. Lord, I said Taimut. I definitely messed that pronunciation up. Oh. That's very helpful here. Old man. <laughs> uh. See, I'm like, now nah, I don't really like how it was animated right there, but, you know... It's okay, though. Jeez. Oh. Oh. 
<laughs> Why aren't you a badass? Yeah, we can pretty much assume this much. I mean, we're just, I mean, we're literally just throwing rocks. So I wouldn't think they'd be doing much of anything. Damn, 50 <laughs> Jeez, I didn't realize 50% of them already are dead. My goodness. My only thing is, who was the they that were able to relay that, <laughs> since no one was really near him? <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> ah, it's kind of too late for that. Damn. Oh. Oh. Well. See, and this is where it's appropriate for him to use this. I really just felt that he used the shield way too soon when we did it in the first episode. Now it makes sense. Y'all about to learn why the shield hero is the shield hero. That's what y'all about to learn. One hundred percent. One hundred percent.
Yeah, y'all are really getting messed up right now, no lie. <laughs> I mean, being as you say, they're one of the same. Bro, we don't got time for you right now. <laughs> Damn, I ain't gonna lie, I thought they all got, <laughs> yo, I thought they all got wiped out right then and there. I'd be like, "Damn." Oh, oh, oh. Definitely helps that they've been training. That's for sure.
Bruh. Bro, what the, what the hell? <laughs> Yo, what? <laughs> no wonder this whole episode felt so anticlimactic. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, a little bit to unpack once this ends. in the fog all right uh, all right so that was episode three and with that episode there's definitely a little bit with this actually i'm glad this episode kind of happened the way it did because it's going to feed into what we're going to talk about here so um episode three uh this fight against the spirit tortoise which now we know is not actually um not actually dead i guess uh, definitely the entire episode, uh, was a little, did it feel a little bit rushed? Yeah. Um, but there are little, were there questionable things with the animation of the tortoise itself? Yeah. And above all, did the entire episode kind of make it so that the entire first three episodes of this season, uh, feel like a filler to what the actual season's going to be? Yes. And so, with those three things said, I will feed into what I wanted to talk about at the end of the video. So, uh, as we all know, Mao is controversial for, uh, for those that don't know Mao, it's the My Anime List, one of the major anime sites that lists all the animes currently running and their reviews and discussions for it. And in the recent check of the ratings, it was discovered that The Rising of the Shield Hero Season 2 actually stands at the bottom of the top 10 list for this season. And to the point that even Love Live Nijigasaki, which of course any idol related show is a very niche community that it targets. And so as of such, it never ranks as highly as, you know, some people would think it would. It's actually even being The Rising of the Shield Hero right now. And so... You know, I thought throughout the day, why is that the case? And then I watched this episode, and I understand why that is the case. And now this feeds into how I feel about the season. So as I told y'all, I've enjoyed the first two episodes of the show, and to a witness, then I did enjoy this episode. But I think that the concerns that a lot of people in the community are expressing about it doesn't feel as magical, it doesn't feel as in-depth and dynamic as the first season did, no, it doesn't. At least not yet. I think that there was a different set of circumstances that we were following in the first season. Uh, Nafumi, you know, being betrayed, becoming the enemy of everything, having to get Raftalia, them finding out she was a slave, and all this other stuff. It made for a lot of interesting dynamics and contrasts in the first season. But because many of those things have now been resolved, and there are people that have a lot of respect for the S.H.I.E.L.D. hero now... The first part of this second season definitely is following things, as I would say, by the book. And since it's following things by the book, you know, now they have this quest where they have to go fight the tortoise, but now they thought they killed it, but the tortoise is not actually dead. The, the issue that I think a lot of y'all are having, and I can understand, is that it feels like, you know, basically every other show that follows this type of plot. And... You would more or less be true by saying that. So for the first time since the second season started, I have to say that I actually think that The Rising of the Shield Hero has fallen a rank or two so far in my ratings at the conclusion of this episode. 
really at no fault of its own, but just because of the fact that it's not really taking too many risks and it's just kind of following things as they're lit, as they're meant to play out. There's nothing overly sophisticated about what's happening. And you don't really feel that path that you don't really feel that, that emotional, uh, the, the emotional tie with, you know, the, 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 this, the emotional, everything that ties together in the emotions of a character. Um, we had a whole bunch of deaths this episode. They didn't feel like anything at all. They just kind of happened. Yeah, they were dead. Okay, 50% of the forces is dead. Cool. Um, but you didn't feel that emotional attachment. I did not know why I was having so many issues finding the word for emotional attachment. My goodness, such a struggle. Uh, but you don't really feel, you didn't really feel that this episode. And for many, you didn't, haven't really felt that throughout this season so far. So I do believe that ne that we'll probably start getting into more of the serious stuff of the episode starting next episode and actually really into what this second season is supposed to be based around, what it's trying to accomplish. But at this current moment, do I see this second season being better than the first season? No, I do not. Uh, I think it might fall just a little bit below what the first season was to me based on how the first three episodes have gone. Despite the fact that I'm still very excited that the show is back. And I do feel that the episodes have done a decent job of bringing the show back to us. Also, I think that with us already knowing that there is a third season, unlike other shows, the third season was was stated at, that it was going to happen at the same time that the second season was. With those two things in consideration, it might be that they're not really trying you know, overly as hard right now because they know that the next season is going to be coming up shortly after this. But that's still not an excuse. In a heavy-hitting season like this spring anime season, you have to really show up and show out to stand above and especially to stand in the top 10 list. And right now, this episode, it's possible it might set, it, might set the show back even further. We might actually see the Rising of the Shield Hero not even make the top 10 this, this coming week when they do the ratings, but time will tell on that. We'll see. Uh, but that's pretty much what I wanted to talk about. And so with this episode, the episode was okay. So um, we'll definitely see, you know, with the twist that, oh, the tortoise is not dead and uh, a girl is still around. Obviously that means that there's definitely some sus stuff going on with her. Um, hopefully we'll get some more answers to that. And yeah, with that said, we are a quarter of the way through this uh, this return of the Rising of the Shield Hero. Um, I hope you did enjoy the reaction and any dialogue I talked about after the fact. I'm, I would love to hear y'all opinions. How do you think the season is going? Uh, please feel free to comment down here. And if you like this video and want to hear more content from here and see more content from me, please like and subscribe to the channel. With that said, you guys take care. Have a good rest of your week. And I'll see you next week for the next reaction of the Rising of the Shield Hero.